Hello everyone and welcome back to Final Fantasy X. I'm Sean. I'm Tanil. And once you know it, it's my turn to go into a temple again. <laughs> wow, how does this keep on happening? Man, I don't know. <laughs> it's almost like it's on purpose. <laughs> Attention! We are ready. All right. Let's do it. And by let's do it, let's have Titus do it. Yep. Well, you know, he's the real brains of the operation. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> All right. Well, there's a whole lot of... I will warn you up front, I feel like this is one of the easiest ones to miss the secret in. Okay. Good to know. Yeah. And those spheres are gone forever! Goodbye, spheres! And in case you can't tell, this one's very electricity based. Yep. Oops. That resets your... Yeah. This looks like a doorway. Eventual doorway. Nice, nice, nice sigh there. Uh, I thought that one blended in pretty well. Um, all right, just taking a look around. Looks like I need to... G give me this. Got a Jose sphere. Okay. That makes it do the electric doobly do. Looks like I just have Jose spheres right now, because it looks like there's another Jose sphere inside the this pedestal. Mm-hmm. Alright, if I remember correctly. Uh-huh. Cause I have done all of these once before. Yeah. I do this, and now I have a supersonic, super-powered, a super-powerful Jose Sphere. Uh-huh. <laughs> now what do? Um... I'm gonna take the super powerful sphere and start shoving it into holes. Valid plan. Hey, look, it worked. Oh. Hey, look, it didn't work. <laughs> okay. Well, now that just made the floor glow, and I feel like if I get the whole thing glowing, I can move forward with my life. That is a good assessment of what's going on. Okay. So I'll open that back up. And what do you do in here? All right, I know what I'm supposed to do, but I don't know if I'm going to do it correctly on the, cr the first try. No. No. I said no. <laughs> no. Okay, well I know how to fix this. You do that, and you got your pedestal back. And then I grab these, because they are shocky. Eh. <laughs> Take this. All right. Now I have double spheres in the pedestal. And, and then I throw it into the pit again. And this time, it floats because magnets. How do they work? Dude, I don't know. Wait. You might want to back up. Oh, there you go. <laughs> okay, he just kind of was like, yeah, I, I can do that now. Oh, I just pushed that. Yep. Oh. Okay. All right. Well, I don't need the, that back there anymore. Nope. 
So I bring this back. Don't need that open anymore either. Nope. But I still have not found my anni Annihilation Glyph. Destruction Sphere. That one. Yep. That thing. I will say you're done with this thingy. Don't need to worry about it anymore. I, I didn't think so, but like I'm at the point where I just need to start shoving things into stuff. Uh-huh. Your main task is to now get the floor all glowy. Well, yes, but, like, I feel like that completes the temple. It doesn't. It doesn't? No. Okay, well, then I know exactly what to do then. Yeah. Because I have to walk back out this way and reinsert glyphs into this thingy, and that'll turn on the both, the two sides. Little wings. Don't take that, please. Just leave it there. <laughs> Put that on there, and now I've made the whole thing glow. Very nice. What did that do? Well, did you see something was happening in your wall? Uh, no, I did not. Yeah, that's really subtle, and it's really easy to miss. There is my destructo sphere. Yep. Now, you can get on that platform. Oh, I do go on the platform? Yep. Okay. I was about to start shoving it into every hole. <laughs> <laughs> nope, nope, you're good. Okay. Can that take me back down if I were to mess Yes. It? Okay, good to know. Um. Okay. Just shove them all in. Gotta do all the zappy doos. This seems incredibly safe. <laughs> Look how close you are to all that electricity. Yeah. Tinas was just two inches taller. Good thing Kamari's not the one doing this. Yeah. Okay, do not touch those stairs. Okay. Oh, it's a pedestal. There hey, you go. We did it. Complete. Yeah, I end up accidentally missing this one. All like, the time. All the time. Every, like every other time I play this, I'm and I'm I'm always like, I always miss this one. Make sure I get it, and then. Like, Do it again. Yeah. Stop pacing around. Be calm and wait. Impossible, Oren. We are fidgety, McGee. You should try to settle down. Yuna will be blamed if anything happens. What am I gonna do? Break the temple? We wait here. <laughs> well, smash it. You again. Still traveling with quite the crowd, I say. What is it, Bartello? You know this riffraff? You are. Are no. What of it? Can I shake your hand? Arin. No, Sir Arin. You're the reason I became a guardian. <laughs> Aww. Thank you, sir. This means so much to me. Calling the personal guardian the Lord Braska Riffraff? And you call yourself a summoner? Yeesh. Bartello, enough. Get back here. Hang in there, buddy. Eh? <laughs> Quite the show, yeah? Not so good on the heart, though. You should try to settle down. Yuna will be blamed if anything happens. 
Let's talk see. to Kamari. Yeah, I can talk to him now. Yeah. Next spot. Shut up. Wait. Well, good talking to you, buddy. You grow stronger, but are still a pup. Not all summoners are like you, I guess. Now we wait. This is also a guardian's duty. Tia's just I running swear. around from person I'll to person. Oh, I'm so bored. Please touch me with that hand and I'll remove it. How much longer? She sure is taking her sweet time. Stop pacing around. Be calm and wait. Stop pacing. Mm. I wait here. Uh huh. Try to leave. Of course. <laughs> uh, I know. I know that's the way to continue on. But it could be really. It's not uh, intuitive. No, it's not. You owe much to your father. All these guardians. And Sir Oren, too? And I hear Maester Seymour is quite taken with you. The world must look different when you're the daughter of Lord Braska. This has nothing to do with my father. I am traveling on my own, as a full-fledged summoner. Oh, is that so? Then try standing on your own two legs for once. Your guardians won't be able to protect you when the time comes. Hey! And now we've got Ixion! A new friend! Who is not going to be named Ixion. No. Instead, their name is... McNugget. McNugget. Gotta get them nuggies. <laughs> This one was suggested to us by, by Raiko. our patron Raiko. Thank you very much for oh making nugget. <laughs> Turn around. Oh, of course. <laughs> we saw that chest in there earlier. We can actually get it now. It contains a switch hitter. Oh, yes. It means I bought that weapon for Waka last episode unnecessarily, but... This is a much better weapon for Waka. Strength plus three, strength plus five. Yes. Good. No matter how dark the night, morning always comes. And our journey begins anew. That is true. Yeah. Leaving once Yuna gets here. Kind of feels like a fresh start, huh? Get ready for the journey ahead. Donna has left. Isaru too. Donna. We're leaving once Yuna gets here. Well, maybe go see if we can find her. Oh, hey, buddy. I'm going back to Besaid. With Luzu gone? Yeah. It'd be hard fighting alone, wouldn't it? Most of the other Crusaders have already left. I'll go soon. Well, good luck, Gata. Sorry you had to witness that. Ooh, not here. Oh, Yuna. There she is. She was working until dawn, healing the wounded, sending the fallen. Okay. I guess I'll just let her sleep for now then. <sighs> Ah, morning. What? Morning? Don't worry. But it's morning. 
I'm so sorry. I'll get ready right away. Just a moment. Oh, oh. Don't worry. It's okay. No, oh, sleepy head. Sorry, I'm so sorry. Please forgive me. Really, there's no rush here. Your hair. <laughs> A summoner with bad hair. What's the world coming to? You could have woken me up. Uh, we called to you, but with all that snoring. Uh, oh. mm. What is it today? Everyone's picking on me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, walk a little close to the camera there, buddy. <laughs> you too, Sir Orin? Once Lady Yuna fixes her hair, we leave. <laughs> I hadn't really laughed like that in a long time. It was only later that I realized. The only one really laughing then was me. Laughing must have been the only thing keeping them going. All right, and we're done with this place. Yep. Time to move on. Crusaders have fallen apart, so I'm going to help out with guard duty here at the temple for a while. It's the least I can do to repay them for taking us in. You can't defeat sin with with Machina. Summoners are our only hope. Yemen's teachings are the way. The Crusaders were fools for defying them. Here, take this. I don't need it anymore. Halberd. Oh, a halberd. The Crusaders deeply regret their actions. I believe it is time to put the past behind us and forgive them. Kevin for gives them seek redemption. You should need a place to recuperate. Please return. You are always welcome here. Well, thank you. Hi, Potion. Hi. Kimari. Magic 20%. That is really good, considering the path we have him going down. Yeah, it doesn't have piercing. No, it doesn't. But, like, I think that's... Well, it's not quite better for him yet, because we don't have him... He doesn't actually have magic yet. True. I beat myself up all night for taking part in that disastrous operation. Then a monk told me that if I had time to, for remorse, I should spend it praying. He's right. It's my duty to pray for my departed men. The monk gave me this, but I think you should have it. Some potions. Nice. Off so early? Lady Yuna, you must be exhausted after working so hard last night. Will you be okay? Uh, I feel that I have rested enough, but thank you for your kindness. Will you be leaving too? Yes. First we cross the moon flow, and then we head north in search of chocobos to replace those we have lost. Once we find chocobos, our mounted forces will ride again. Huh? Aren't you missing someone? Captain, wait for me! <laughs> what took you so long? We're leaving. You expect me to keep up with a chocobo? Lady Yuna, I wish you good fortune. Elma, Clasco, let's go. Ma'am. Hey, can I just rest a sec? No complaints. Poor Clasco, you need to get out of there. <laughs> You're always getting left behind by these ladies. Where to next? We cross the Moonflow. Gotcha. Moonflow, baby, here we come. All right. Say that as though you know what the Moonflow is. <laughs> I well, guess. we're gonna find out what the moon flow is. It's not much of a wound. I should be able to go on, but I can't. We've always fought side by side. Now we go back home together. Yeah. 
<laughs> ah! <laughs> and now we've got a new uh, variation on the Uchu. He's basically the same, um, but tougher now. Cool. Well, you know what? Uh huh. Let's try out McNugget. Do it! There he is! My name's Yuna. Pleased to meet you. My name's McNugget! <laughs> I am a zebra poodle unicorn. <laughs> Let's go! I don't really see those zebra stripes. I see that as like his rib cage. Hmm. It could be. Uh damages an enemy and negates all spell effects. Sure. Five forty. Not a lot of damage. Regular attack. Whoa, that way was a crit. better. Well, that was a crit. So let's try that again. Okay, a little less than arrow spark. Yeah. Oh, we hurting. Yeah. Well, you know what we have? We have Thundara that we can use on ourselves. Yep. To heal, because just like Ifrit. We are an elemental creature, and attacking ourselves with said element makes us stronger. Uh, well, healed. Yeah. yeah. I don't know if I can kill it with a super yet, so I'm going to hit it like one or two more times, just okay. to be sure. All right. Now I'm going to... Go for it. Yeah. Yeah. Do it. We'll die if not. But time for Thor's hammer. Pick it up. Shock it even more. And slam. There we go. Oh, yeah. I'm glad I did those extra hits because it wouldn't have killed it otherwise. Yeah. There we go. Yeah, good That's stuff. That's what McNugget's got for us. Electricity in like, lots. Spades? Spades. Yeah, that's the term. I was going to say spurns, and I was like, that's not right. Hey, Shalinda. From what has happened to the Crusaders, only the truly faithful have a hope of defeating sin. Well, that's Talk to her again. Also, there's a little nook there. I'm thinking of going to Guado Salam. I have not spoken with a Guado for some time. Okay. Well, we'll probably see you there. Hey, and three level one key spheres. Neat. Nah. Oh, Everyone, it's another one. Shot. Yes. That was a long distance. Oh my god, we're just fighting these things nonstop. Uh huh. It's the big new enemy in the area, so. Nice. Hey, got a couple people ready to level up. Indeed. So let's go ahead and do that. Move down here, please. Some magic defense. And evasion. And agility. Do you want to move him? He only has two. All right, you right, you right. Now we could unlock that one. Where does that take us? Hold on. Ah, okay, that's over to Waka's path. I'm always curious where it's possible to change characters up. Mm.
And there we go. She now has all all four of the magics. Yep. All four of the Raz. All right, and then I'd move uh, Yuna and Lulu down. Other way. I remember these two. Yeah. Hey, guys. Look, one of Kimari's friends looks just like him. What? Both follow summoners on all fours. Hornless goatlings. Hornless! Hornless! <laughs> you come to insult Kimari? Wrong. We come to warn little Kimari. Summoners disappear. Never return. Next will be Kimari's summoner. Poor Kimari! Lost his horn! Next lose his summoner! Pitiful Kimari! Howl alone! Howl alone! <laughs> you know... Do those two... Uh, got something against you? What? They were just picking on you? Kimari would deal with them. And I'll help. Kimari alone. But, uh... It's Kimari's problem. He can't interfere. It's a rule. I'm worried. Let the Ronso deal with Ronso problems, yeah? That's how it's always been. I mean, I'm worried about those summoners disappearing. They aren't just disappearing into thin air. Hey, if we Guardians do our job, no problem, right? Oh. Confident. Yeah. Hmm. Also, for them wanting to warn Kamari, it sure sounded like more of a threat. Mm-hmm. Oh, my God. <laughs> There's a lot of these guys. All right, got a couple more ready to level up. Waka and Titus. Power. Strength. Wow, he's getting a little bit of everything. Yeah, he is. Which is good. He's been a little uh, weak compared to the other characters what in does, this area. What does Drain do? Drain allows him to get MP back. Oh, I see. Yes. Late game, actually. Waka is a fairly decent magic user. I could see that. That high level of accuracy, I'm sure, helps a lot. Get everybody all healed up. Good to go. Going on down the road. More random enemies, but at least they're not Ochus. Yep. Going on down the road, going on down the road. Yeah. Getting treasures to find along the way. Finding, finding Ochus. more Ochus. Oh boy. Everybody loves the Ochus. Hmm. <laughs> uh... <laughs> <laughs> That's bad. She does have a full gauge now, though. That's nice. Oh, that's bad. He's gonna die after doing this. Yep. Yeah. Get up. Oh. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh no. <gasps> Silence! Oh no! Switch out! Yep. Bring Kamari back, too. Use, use, a, use a Phoenix. This is bad.
Like, you're almost done, but you don't want to... Alright, everyone's poisoned. You don't want to whiff right here at the end. There we go. Okay. Oh god, these guys are rough. Whew, yeah, they are. I definitely feel like we're a little under leveled. Yeah. But hey, Orin and Kamari can now level up as well. And we got a couple of new uh new items. New armors. Serum Bracer. Poison Ward and Dark Ward. Poison Ward. Yeah, might be useful right now. Level up! Get that good, good magic! Kitty cat want to learn the dark arts. Not quite. Next time, though. Yep. Alright, there we go. Perfect. And probably heal people. <laughs> Woof. Okay. This is a long road. It only feels long because, like you said, we are a little underleveled. Okay. Right. Well, we're in the middle of nowhere, but you know what? This is a good time to stop. So we're going to stop here. So join us back here next time as we progress on to the Boonflow, whatever the hell that is. <laughs> See you then.